Here's Dr. Rackett using Intermediate Student with Lambda. We'll require some tools from picturing programs. I also want to build some stuff with a Barracuda. So I'll copy it into the program. I'll name it Bar for short. I'd like to be able to rotate bar one degree at a time. This is what I mean. I expect rotate one to work on other images. For example, that hacker that comes along with picturing programs. When I click run, ah, there's an error because I haven't defined Rotate 1 yet. So let's get on that. First, a contract that I write for myself, not for Dr. Rackett, that says Rotate 1 takes an image and produces an image. And a summary sentence that says whatever image is provided, I rotate it by one degree. Now I'm ready to define Rotate 1. The keyword define rotate one, and then a placeholder for an image. And now I say what I do to the image. Rotate it by one degree. I click run, I pass all the tests. Now I can use rotate one on bar. There's bar rotated a little bit. Alt P takes me up. I can edit that and rotate an already rotated bar. I can take it a step further and rotate an already rotated already rotated bar. But this is getting labor intensive. I would like bar to respond to ticking of some kind of cosmic clock. So I'll use Big Bang to start a universe that's really simple. It just consists of bar responding, responding to the clock for now. On every tick of the cosmic clock I'll rotate bar one degree. Try running that. Oops, Big Bang wants to know how to draw a bar. So I can edit my Big Bang invocation and say to draw, just show my universe. Click run. Oops, bar is rotating, but that isn't what I had in mind. I'm going to have to fix this next video.